We're live at the White House tonight. More of our political coverage in just a moment. We want to alert you. We're not sure exactly what's happening here, so I certainly do not want to alarm you. From time to time, packages are left here, and they go on to high alert. But the Secret Service has just rushed out of the White House moments ago. Guns drawn is the part that is interesting. I covered this building for eight years. You see right there, someone has jumped the fence. You see on the video here, crawling on the fence. Uh, sometimes this happens, unfortunately, as a stunt. Uh, it has happened in the past, something more serious. You see the person has been told by the Secret Service to lie on the ground there. You see the backpack on the grounds there. Watch this situation play out. We'll stay with it live. You're watching. This is the north side of the White House. That is Pennsylvania Avenue to the left of your screen through the gate there. Uh, again, officers, the uniformed Secret Service officers coming out of the building, coming out of the compound around here. There were some, several dozen protesters, which is pretty routine, outside of the fence. Uh, they were rushed away by the Secret Service, and they voluntarily went away. Uh, no indication that this gentleman who has jumped, with the f jumped the fence has anything to do with that. Uh, again, this does happen from time to time. Somebody trying to make a political statement sometimes. Somebody just answering a dare. Uh, as you can see right there, face down on the lawn, following the instructions of the Secret Service. You see the officers approaching now. It's the cat team approaching in the darker uniforms, their dog as well. It's, the dogs are capable of sniffing explosives. And now you see, if you're ever thinking about this, the inevitable result when you hop that fence. Again, we have no indication as to the motivation of the individual who decided to jump the fence here. We're going to watch this coverage. We're going to watch this unfold. Uh, one of the things we don't like to do is give too much coverage to this. If it is a political stunt, it would encourage somebody else to do it. So we're going to turn away from this for now and come back to our coverage. But we will find out for you exactly what has happened here, if the Secret Service has any information as to just why this individual has hopped the fence, whether or not it was any threat or just a political stunt. We'll get more information for that as it unfolds. Bit of breaking news here at the White House. You never know what happens when you come down here. But the Secret Service, as always, performing quickly and admirably to bring it to a close. We'll follow up on that. Now, the debt ceiling... Quick update at a security lockdown here at the White House. You see that backpack. That's a live image of the White House lawn for you. A man jumped over the fence a short time ago with that backpack. He has been taken into custody. We can show you those pictures right there. There's a lockdown here, though, until the bomb squad can come in and check that backpack out to make sure, to make sure uh, there is no danger to that. We are waiting for that procedure to take place here at the White House. As we do, we will keep you updated. You can see the suspect taken into custody. This on a day in which the president signed into law that debt ceiling compromise agreement. Now, it's a deal that didn't give him...